uh, you know, I just wanted to give them a tip or an advice, you know, before they get into the tech field or continue the tech field and upskill themselves. So, a small tip for our audience who are watching this video. Yeah, my suggestion is like, uh, are you googling? No, no, no. no. Yeah, my suggestion is like, uh, yeah. strong your basics, like uh, whatever learning in your tech school. Hello guys, welcome to yet another Open School. Today we have Abhijit with us. Hello Abhijit, how are you doing? Yeah, I'm good. Have you watched our pre previous sessions on YouTube? Yeah, yeah, I used to watch the like, preview and all about your Okay, yeah. that, well that's great, that's great. Cool, so tell me something about uh, uh, from which background you are. Are you from tech, I mean CS or did you switch your Feel. Yeah, I am. Like, I would like to introduce myself. Like, okay. Basically, yeah, I'm okay. from Karnataka. Uh, okay. I did my graduation in mechanical uh, from the University of Ethiopia, and I okay. completed my graduation in um, last year, which is 20, 2021. Okay. Yeah. After that, like, uh, basically, I'm from Tier Three College. Uh, okay. Like, you know. The placements will work in that college. Okay. Like Got it. The companies which are came to that college was training institute itself. Uh, after that, uh, yeah, I joined it. Like it was uh, one month of training on Java, uh, and I didn't get any placement there. Mm. Okay. okay. After that, uh, so, yeah, 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 yeah. Simultaneously. Uh, I was following a YouTuber called uh, mm -hmm. Abdul Talks. You may know him. Uh, who will do the uh, videos on career uh, content. Mm -hmm. One day he did the video on Newton School. Uh, yeah, I I was like I was I used to believe in on on his content. Yeah, uh, from there I joined in Newton School. That was. Good. Uh, like basically, I'm from mechanical background. Okay, so you are from mechanical background when you switched your career in coding, right? Oh, yeah. Cool. So, was there any particular reason that you saw that you needed to, you know, switch to coding? Yeah, I told like uh, I attended one month of uh, training on Java. There, I found oh. found interest on coding, and Got it. Uh, I also. Uh, Consider the scope of the ID field. Like, yeah, that's correct. Yeah, that was my main motive. Got it. So, uh, while you joined uh, Newton School, you started your journey in coding. So, being from a mechanical background, how uh, did you feel that would you be able to pick up or, you know, it was hard in the beginning, it was tough in the beginning, but later on you coped up with it. So, how was the feeling? How was the experience there, being from a mechanical background? Yeah, like I had a confidence that I I will learn the web development, uh, especially the front end. Was it really difficult for you to cope up with coding? Yeah, of course, like it was difficult at the starting, and I I would like to say one thing: uh, you join a Newton school and that uh, you get the file like job uh, yeah so that, you are trying to say that you also have to put individual effort you individual also effort like uh, inter uh, newton school yeah. will will do the their their work correct correct you also need to do your work plus yeah. you uh, have to uh, you know newton school will help you to get the job okay. so it is from both yeah. sides from you and newton school correct yeah that was that what i Got it, got it. So, so yeah, a lot of people have told me this as well. Individual, you know, efforts and hard work is very, very important as well. Uh, unless and until you are determined about getting a job, uh, you know, it will be a bit difficult. But if you are determined and you are focused on studies and, you know, uh, achieving your goal, then you will definitely get a job in the tech field. Yeah. Correct. So tell me something about, you know, how was mentor sessions helpful for you? How was the mentor 
and how did the mentor help you basically yeah it was good like uh, before that i would like to uh, take the uh, interesting part of it so like cool the instructor cool. instructor for uh, very good uh, like guy great and the new school will do some a good practice for the student like uh, by doing assignments and the mock uh, uh, which is very very like which helped me to crack my interview like yeah got like if i okay. if i would like to say about mentor session that's it like, whatever the doubts we we had yeah clear it okay. so that was mentors right so how did mock interviews help you how much mock interviews did you give from open school uh yeah, in mock in mock interviews uh there were levels like uh, easy medium uh correct, hard and correct. challenging level correct i think i cleared till hard level in all text stack uh, okay um, if i talk about my company interview company interview that was uh, i will compare with the uh, medium level of my mock that that much of uh, easy was my company interview so you were pretty confident about giving mock uh, about giving the actual interview because you gave a lot of mock interviews correct yeah yeah that's what i mean. correct so did it did it help you in you know communication uh, confidence building yeah it's like uh, i was before the joining of newton school i was like weak in communication after that i yeah got it. made the progress in that so how did you you know uh, how was the feeling when you got your job in newton school how was the feeling it's a great thing to me like uh, i joined in a company called epsilon with a city free that yes uh, which is a great for me yeah i'm very happy cool that's nice how are you proud of yourself you know as you told that you were uh, a bit under confident when you come when it comes to communication and other skills as well and you were also from another field which is mechanical and you switched to coding and inside i think uh, a very short span of time uh, you got a good job i think in coding so are you proud of yourself are you yeah i feel myself very proud like uh, yeah i told like i am from mechanical right yes after that i shifted to it field and cracked the correct. it card yeah correct i am very lucky to say that like i placed after right after 6 months correct yeah. that is amazing that is amazing because you are not even from the tech field you know you did your back, uh, degree in mechanical and getting a yeah. tech job uh, in a decent good company with a good amount of salary in just 6 months is it's very it's very nice actually and i really think that you should be proud of yourself because the hard work that you have put in in 6 months must be really really uh, tough for a lot of people uh, but you did it and that is one very good thing it shows out that how hard working you are how focused you are good job abhijit i'm getting a job yeah it's cool cool so how did you celebrate when you got the job did you celebrate it with the family friends yeah when i got the call from the hr from the company like, yeah i really love offer the offer letter for you that time i share this uh, what share this news with our family members and they are so very happy yeah that was <laughs> nice. uh, that's a great moment for nice amazing amazing yeah so did you go out for dinner or did you do any kind of you know celebration with your family or friends no not really like actually we didn't get the first salary right <laughs> 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 yeah correct correct it makes complete sense okay yeah cool um, so uh, one more thing where are you from you are from karnataka right 
Where in Karnataka? Yeah. Uh, in Karnataka, I'm from Udupi district, which is a okay, uh, okay. coastal area. You may know. Beach area. Oh, I heard that there is a red alert in Udupi, right? Yeah, everything fine yeah. there. Now it's okay, like. Now it's okay. Cool. So you must have been going to a lot of beaches and all. Well. Beaches and all. Yeah. Right? Nice. I really miss beaches because I'm in Bangalore and I was from Mumbai. So I, there was a lot of beaches there. So I spent my most of the time in, in beaches. But now I'm in Bangalore. There's no beaches here. It is just building. That's fine. And you, About, you definitely yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you, you will definitely like the a full day would be like it's yeah so tasty. Yeah, I'm planning to go to a beach as well because of the red alert thing is quite difficult now. Cool. Uh, so, uh, one last thing I want to ask you that, uh, you know, there are a lot of people who are watching this video and just like you uh, cleared all, you know, obstacles and you got a job in just six months being from a mechanical field. There are a lot of people who are thinking to switch their field in coding from a different field or for the people who want to upskill themselves in coding. Uh, you know, I just wanted to give them a tip or an advice, you know, before they get into the tech field or continue the tech field and upskill themselves. So a small tip for our audience who are watching this video. Yeah, my suggestion is like, uh, are you Googling? No, no, no. Yeah, my suggestion is like, uh, uh, strong, like strong, your basic, like uh, whatever learning in your tech school. Uh, and companies all like won't expect much. They are they also expecting basic things from me. Yeah. yeah. And, and I said, as I said, like uh, do the self study. It it will very very important. Right. Right? Yeah. That was my suggestion. Cool. No problem. Uh, I think that's the end of it. Uh, Thank you so much, Abhijit. It was really nice talking to you. And I hope that it was a good conversation for you as well. Yeah, this is the first time like I'm giving interview. That's why I'm little. Yeah. That's good. So you're feeling good, right? You're not nervous. You're completely... Yeah, yes. I'm all nervous for you. I won. <laughs> cool. Okay. No problem. Uh, cool. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye. Yeah. Bye.